You know, typically I think that it would be a good idea for all of humanity to understand that if we want to make a peaceful world, we all have to maintain a society that has a consciousness of taking care of itself. I think that the younger generations probably have a better advantage uh, at having a healthier world than we do. The older generations came from the hard knocks. We came from the grit, you know, the the um, the desperation of humanity's uh, ignorance and stupidity, you know, and we are at the precipice of a, a long time coming evolutionary change within the consciousness of humanity. And so now we're all kind of starting to wake up to the bullshit. We're all starting to see that what we've been doing for the last, I don't know, freaking 500 years isn't really working anymore. And we have to make better decisions in how we treat the environment, how we treat each other, um, you know, and, and just how we treat life in general. And, and so the younger generations are really going to benefit that as long as we maintain it. We don't want to degress in our evolution and our awareness of the lessons that we have learned and the struggle that we have overcome. Yes, struggle makes us stronger, but sometimes we reach a point of evolution where we have to change the way we struggle. You know what I'm saying? So even struggle needs improvement. <laughs> And a lot of people are like, well, no, you know what? Don't come up on me with biased, okay? Life is what it is, not what you say it is, okay? We all deal with things differently, and we all have similar and different needs. And I think that moving forward, if we want a better future, we have to really apply that knowledge and awareness, okay? Um, there's so many different things going on in the world right now that are challenging our awareness and our ability to work together. The war in Ukraine, environmental disasters, famine, disease, um, political and so social injustices. Okay, it's just a constant whirlwind of chaotic change and struggle right now. It's amazing that humanity has actually even made it this far in the last two years. I mean, it's been crazy. And I'm blessed enough, along with everyone else around me, to have even survived what has happened to the world in the last two years. But the people who have survived need to realize that it's a blessing that we are here to make a difference in this world and to um, really help the awareness of um, maintaining kindness and care for each other. So that's all I really wanted to say. Um, Mercury retrograde is really powerful right now. Like it's just, it's like clearing. I'm like, whew, I am like wide awake right now. It is really just go time. Um, it feels good though. It feels good to be awake. It feels good to be able to process things and not feel frozen all the time. You know, it's, we, we really got to wake up and uh, take care of each other no matter what happens. No matter what happens, that's the deal right now. That's the deal. That's how it's going to be, whether you like it or not. Um, eventually, war is going to be a thing of the past, um, you know, and, and starvation is going to be a thing of the past. Um, even deprivation is going to be a thing of the past. We're moving forward into a new future that is peaceful, prosperous, healthy, and unified. And there's nothing anyone can do it. And there's no one that's going to be able to control it. Not even Trump. Be careful how much power you give him.